Um, there we go. Uh, uh, well, <laughs> apologies for that. And also, um, apologies to anyone who may have been watching the last, last stream. Uh, sorry if it felt like it ended, um, abruptly, but computer crashed, uh, and now I'm trying something else to see if it does not crash. I mean, that was after 12 hours, so it may not happen because I don't know if I'm going to go for 12 hours again like I did the, the last time, but either way, uh, I, still, I still give my apologies for that, but um, and it's been it's been a like a week or so, so um, I figured since I am currently here and able to access my PC, then I will uh, I'll do I do yes I do. Uh, here we go. I don't even remember. I have no clue what I was doing last. But, um. I think I retrieved the Declaration of Independence and. Uh, gave it to. the person that was at the museum uh, in Rivet City. But, um. Oh, and I kept Sydney from dying. Uh, reloaded, like, maybe <laughs> ten or so times, but... Here we go. Load this game. Oh, as long as it doesn't... I was gonna say, as long as it doesn't crash off the bat. Okay. Well, the game seems to be running okay right now. The heck. Uh. So now to uh, evade copyright, I'm listening to my own music, not through desktop audio but through my phone because you know if it was on stream then it would be copyright so can't do that unless I want to risk getting striked or uh, the content ID putting ads on my videos and whatever else so you know not gonna not gonna have that happen if I can help it. Oh boy. Come on now. But I've just been listening to um, my SoundCloud lights. Uh, SoundCloud liked section. Anything that I've liked on SoundCloud. Just going through it to see if there's any songs that I don't like listening to anymore. <laughs> so. Oh boy, I just passed it. There it is. But anyway, back to. Oh, hello, friend. I have more than half health. Five bottle caps. But it might have been my RAM. My RAM was set to uh, 1866 megahertz when uh, 
natively, I guess I could say. The RAM was, um, it's 1600 megahertz, so it was running faster with the same timings that go for its native speed, so. Uh, it was somewhat of an overclock, I guess, and my north bridge and hyper transport speed were increased to compensate with the RAM speed, so that might also be part of it. Like, the uh, the memory controller could have been um, not getting enough voltage, but I don't, uh, don't want to give it more voltage, so this board is already... Um, you know, using an unsupported processor, so giving giving this board voltage, uh, I would say, is spicy. I mean, but I have overclocked on it, so I mean, uh, it hasn't been recommended to do that by people that I saw because uh, on some forums there were people that were trying to overclock on this specific board and uh, I just saw probably a few few or so recommendations to not be doing that so uh, I still did it anyway on my uh, last processor that I was using with it and uh, it seemed okay it seemed fine but I don't really know I don't gonna say, were they gonna follow me? Oh. Jet. Well, I'll sell that next place I get to, or the trader. How much health do I have? 71. I'll do a stim pack. Eh, 24 HP, but 5 rats. Where's this telling me to go? I don't know where the marker is actually going to. Goes right here, and then oh, Grognak the Barbarian. I guess down that tunnel. Melee weapons increased by two. Open up. What's inside? Burn Square. Okay. Ooh. I guess I have not been here yet. Ooh. There's a friend up there. Oh, they saw me. Hey now. Hey now. Okay. No more, please. Just go right here. And do that. Oh. And here they come. Maybe. Oh boy. To this caution. Take it with Thor. Uh, bye bye. Getting out of here. Still caution. It's okay though. Statesman Hotel. 
saying right here. Uh, okay. Our Lady of Hope Hospital. Okay. We'll go through the hospital. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Cups. Oh, okay, this is... This updated the quest, so... Maybe this is the way. Empty. Terminal's non-activatable. Open up. Oh, hello, friend. Please, no. Oh, torso crippled. And <laughs> just explodes. Unfortunate. Can't can't play the music on stream. Oh, hello, pal. Let's let's uh I <laughs> could use this. I don't think I'm gonna do that though. Save those for later. Okay, four health. There, I'll actually heal up here. Hey, no more of that, please. Whew. Oh, hi, friend. What are you? Um, hey, pal. Oh, oh. Look out. They got this. Eutronic. And pets. <laughs> minigun. <laughs> Is my minigun uh, uh, okay? Oh, there. I can actually fix it more. What's my combat shotgun like? Ooh, below half condition. So, um, use this. Because even when it's damaged, I think it does more than the, uh, regular assault rifle. Open up. What's inside? Ooh, uh oh. Bye. Solid, but still wanted to activate it. Get rid of as many duds as I can before I go in. As long as they're them then. So then, claiming merchant. There we go. Robco Trespasser Management System. Reconfigure targeting parameters. Target data cleared. Exercise caution. Oh! System information. Activate turret system. Warning, no targeting data. <laughs> Please ex Okay, so then, yeah, maybe I don't want to activate those, actually. I don't know. Because of, uh, Riley's Rangers. I don't want them to get, uh, shot by turrets. 
then again, I don't really know where they are, so... Oh, there we go. Pre-war book. Can give that to the one, uh, Brotherhood of Steel, um, member. At the, uh, library. Oh, hello, pal. Ouch. Yeah. Ooh. Um. Okay. Uh, rip. I guess there was a uh, frag mine there. Garbage can. Oh, another Edatronic. Potato crisps. Oh wait, I have the... Do I have the sugar bombs? Yes, I do. I do have the sugar bombs for that one quest. Oh, nice. Okay. True to doors. Stimpak. I mean, machine. I'll keep the Nuka Colas there. Oh. <laughs> nice. Psycho. Stim packs, ooh. Three stim packs and two med axes. Nurse's station. I don't know if this is the safe or not, but I will see. This might be. If I don't get this, it might just be faster to guess. Flavoring, gotten, gratitude. Oh, unlocked med supplies, unlocked injury report. 0908 7768. Patient name Tom Malone. Injury Extreme muscle injury to groin area. Diagnosis. Mr. Malone was admitted to by the staff at the Statesman Hotel across the street with an extremely painful pull of pull in the groin region of his body. He in, indicated he was in the company of one Miss Seneca Clarkson at the time, but would not disclose what caused it. The muscles affected are the gracilis muscle and the Adductor longus muscle. Treatment, medicine, and physical therapy recommended. Injury report 09087790. Patient name Harold Worthington. The third. Injury, sharp pain in knees and in left arm from a fall. Diagnosis Mr. Worthington has. Oh, was admitted by the staff at the Statesman Hotel across the street with an aforementioned with the aforementioned pains. He claims to have fallen by slipping on some water left on the ground by a faulty ice machine in the hotel. After an overnight stay and extensive testing, we can find no injuries to treat. Please also note that Mr. Worthington asked for at least eight pillows to help him sleep and when the room was cleaned the next day after he was discharged, they were all gone. Treatment, none. Injury report, 09087882. Patient name, Richard Maynard Watson. Injury, eyes were splashed with caustic chemicals. Diagnosis, Mr. Watson was admitted by some of his fellow employees at the 
Hubris Comics facility. Apparently one of the press machines malfunctioned and sprayed hot steam and caustic chemicals into his face and hands, causing severe burns and nerve damage. Due to the nature of his injuries, he was flown to Hopkins in the Bal in Baltimore for oh no, I missed it. For special care. Treatment preferred. Okay. Oh no, here they come with a sledgehammer. No more police. No more police. No more police. Thank you. Sledgehammer and Radaroge meet. No more. 32 caliber. Oh, hunting rifle. Pair mine. No, because I've used it. Uh oh. It's the whole room. Uh. Okay. Maybe not that then. Let's see. Laser pistol. There. Cleared that out. And this has 15 bullets, so on to on to a different weapon. Could use the minigun now. Uh, I could use the laser rifle too. You know what, I'll use this for the 15 bullets. Open up. What's that? Okay. It's out of ammo. So then... <sighs> Minigun, I guess. Frag grenade. I'll throw that at some point. Maybe. Weapons. Hunting rifle. Mine's already paired as far as I can. So then. I guess I'll use it. What up? Okay. Cross I go question mark. I there was a thought I saw an ammo box. Might have just been the rubble. Oh, here you go. Did I disarm it? Oh no! Okay. Uh oh. Oh. Look out. Got fists. No more, please. Oh. No items on the centaur. Smaller and book. Tin can, tin can. Oh, 
Um, okay. This way? Oh, hey. Stim pack. Oh, Theo. Theo's ammo box. There, I located the ammo crate. The oh. 556 five, rounds. Ooh. Explosion. Up I... okay, maybe not up I go. <laughs> this way. Whoa. Hey there, pal. <laughs> no more of that, please. Frag grenades. Here. Have this. Ouch. Here, have this. Here, have this. Here, have this. Okay. Hey, now. You're hungry. Got some food if you, you know. I got some sugar bombs. I don't have to sell all of them. Okay. Oh, Chinese assault rifle. Pair mine with that one. There we go. Oh, now I have ammo for it again. more relaxed where is that okay book <sighs> try to find my way Not really sure. Oh, there we go. Is this a door to go through? Okay. Oh, hi. Another frag grenade. Up I go. I'm gonna save before I get further in. Save over this. Just waiting for the radiation to stop.
Ooh. Hello. Uh. Uh, okay. Another frag grenade. I have two, I think. Super Mutant Master. <laughs> Weapons. You know what? Use this until it's like broken. No more police. Another Chinese assault rifle. <laughs> Repair mine again. There you go. Elevator to statement or statesman hotel restaurant. The elevator panel needs to be repaired in order to operate the elevator. Okay. Repair the elevator panel. You successfully repaired the elevator panel. Okay. Ooh. Unlock it. Oh, hi. No more. Grenade. Oh, here they come. Uh, yes. Um, yes. Go oh, five millimeter minigun. Uh, here we go, minigun. Repair minigun. Forty one damage. Use this. Um, hey pal. more so I wouldn't be able to shoot their foot but nope I can shoot their foot still uh, okay there okay there we go <laughs> This way. Go get that Nuka Cola Quantum. There we go. Uh, ammo boxes. Didn't see these initially. And shells. Another Grognak the Barbarian. Read that. 
some millimeter rounds. Okay. And I shall continue. Fresco or lounge? Remember, after using the restroom, don't just walk out without cleaning up. Take a look around and see if there's any toilet tissues lying about and pick them up. Our customer always appreciates a clean restroom. Seats available. Currently 100% of the seating available. Okay. It's back down to the middle level. So this way. Um, oh. Medicine. Blood pack. Oh, there we go. Blood pack, because those actually give me 20 health now. <laughs> so, I'll use that. Didn't want to do that. So that goes. Yeah, that's not going there. So the question is where do I go? Uh. Oh. No more. Empty. Bobby pin, purified water, and two stem packs. Again, and there we go. Watch for those grenades. Okay, pick this up. 32 caliber. Uh, what is my hunting rifle like? Did I use it again? <laughs> to damage it? Oh, yep. There we go. Full repair again. Those are empty. Ooh. Wait, this is where I was, I think, before. Or maybe not? Oh no. No, 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 I think this... <laughs> I think this is where I've been before. I don't know where I go then from here. This... No, I've been down this way. And I went through here. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I'm not, uh, not really sure where to go now. I can go back through here again, but... Um... Yeah, I, uh... I don't have any clue where to go. Up here, maybe? Because maybe I haven't been up here yet. Uh, okay, yep. Open up. 
out this door to the roof. His <laughs> Tim Pack's taken 293. Oh. They may have already been looted. Woo! Uh, hello, friends. Hey, you! Get your ass over here before you attract every super mutant in the building. Okay. The name's Butcher. I'm the team medic. It's good to see a friendly face. Okay, now, who the heck are you and when are reinforcements coming? I'm afraid this is it. Hmm, you made it all the way up here alive. Okay, I'm impressed. Riley must have sent the right person for the job, as usual. Hey, is she okay? Yeah, she's fine. They patched her up and she's resting in Underworld. That's a relief. I told her she was nuts when she decided to try to sneak out of here. Guess I was wrong. Now, let's talk about getting out of here. I would have proposed going back the way you came, but apparently it's impossible now. So, the express elevator is our only solution. Doesn't look like the elevator works anymore. You're right. What we need is something to power the elevator motor up here and get the thing going. On the way up here, I'm pretty certain we passed a maintenance room. Inside was a wrecked Protectron. If you can get me its fission battery, I can have Donovan jury rig the elevator. Okay, I'll go back and look for the fission battery. Maybe I can fix the elevator. Maybe you can, but we'd still need the fission battery. It's the only way to locally feed power into the elevator's electronics. Okay, I will go back and look for the fission battery. <laughs> Alright, we'll hold the roof position here. If any of us goes down, don't stop. Get the hell out of here and make for our HQ, Ranger Compound. Okay. Locate the fission battery. Well, I'll go look for the fission battery and see if I can find it. Oh. Oh. Pick up the 32 caliber rounds. Okay. Just go. Just do this. Where is this? Right here? Uh... Oh, okay. Fission battery. I see. <laughs> Give a fission battery to Donovan. I'm back. Well, I will be back. Get the fission battery. Open up. So you're the reinforcements, huh? Crazy. Hey there. Donovan at your service. You break it, I fix it. I have a fission battery that will fix that express elevator. Let me have that thing. Give me a few minutes. 
and I'll have the elevator up and running. As soon as I get it online, we'll get out of here. Which elevator? <laughs> this elevator? I thought it was already... Um... Oh, okay, I was gonna say. I thought I repaired the other thing before, but... I guess not this one. Oh. Good to see you in one piece. Oh, okay. Oh, oh hey. Gonna stand in the way. Hey, knock it off. <laughs> who said who said that? <laughs> Pair. No, oh, mine's at max, so. Just drop this one. Hey, all right. Me and Eugene are glad to see you. Where'd Donovan go? Did not a Donovan die? Um. Um. Okay. I don't know where Donovan went. Blood pack, bobby pin, stim pack. Lock pick this and then open the term terminal because then I'll get double XP. Oh, okay. Exit. Back in. Auto cap, energy cell, pre-war money, and a laser pistol. What's mine like? Repairable, okay. Now get into this terminal. And... There goes. Yes, check in. Check availability. Oh, reservation server unavailable. Unlock front desk safe. Unlocked. Yes, check in. Okay. Guest complaint files. Complaint. Oh, please have guests be as descriptive as possible. Complaint 0001. Instant level 3, minor. Guest name, Harold Worthington III. Mr. Worthington claims that the ice machine on the second floor was leaking water, which caused the tile floor to get wet. He then apparently slipped and fell after spending the night up in the alfresco. On the way back to his room, he demanded restitution in the form of free room service or some more of those damn pillows. I found Mr. Worthington to be quite unreasonable and abusive on the phone. Complaint 0002. Instant level 1 major. Guest name, Seneca Clarkson. Miss Clarkson has been found dead in room 302 in the bed after a state of... Oh, in a state of undress. She has been suffocated by a plastic bag placed over her head and couldn't help herself from this predicament due to her limbs being tied to the bedpost. The man who reported the incident was taken into custody and told us that it was only a bit of fun. Miss Clarkson is well known to be a highly valued escort for this facility and it is assumed she perished in the line of duty. Complaint 0003 
Instant level 2. Intermediate. Guest name, Wanda Kaladine. Incident. Miss Kaladine reported the smell of cooking coming from her room 202. We immediately dispatched a security guard to her room to ascertain the source of the smell. After the investigation, the entire... Oh, after investigating the entire room, the guard discovered that the electronic blanket we provided her was malfunctioning and literally burned her legs. When asked when, why she didn't feel any of the pain, she immediately replied, Honey, I've been married for 40 years and I raised 8 kids. What the hell is pain? That and the myriad of empty pill bottles we found seemed to answer the question. Complaint 0004 Instant level 3, minor. Guest name, Harold Warren Worthington the third. No, this is Mr. Worthington's second incident this month. Apparently he claims that the carpeting on the steps lead, leading to the alfresco lounge was coming up, which caused him to trip and fall down. He says that he was making his way back to his room after a whole night up in the alfresco lounge and had the accident. As before, he demanded restitution in the form of free room service or some more of those damn pillows. Once again, I found Mr. Worthington to be quite unreasonable and uh, abusive on the phone. I believe we have now relinquished 23 pillows to this hotel regular over the last 10 months. Okay. Oh. Alright. Oh. Again, I'm not sure how to thank you. I'm going to head back to Ranger Compound to see if Riley's back yet. Look me up anytime you're in the neighborhood. If I can ever be of medical assistance or you need some supplies or repairs, let me or Donovan know. Okay, Donovan lived. now oh do they come question mark where are they at oh there they are oh my eyes and my arm and leg <laughs> yeah Okay, I think they might have thrown a grenade. <laughs> hey now. Um. Where go? There you go. Oh! Okay. Hello, friends. Follow me! Oh jeez. Oh hi. Ouchie. 
Okay, up here. No question mark. Where do they go? Um, uh, where is they? Where are they? Are they up there? Might be up top. I'm gonna try to get get up there, I guess. Oh. Hey now. Yeah. There you go. Is this even a place to like... I don't think this is actually like a uh... I don't know, this might be an open building. I guess I'll see. I don't know, there's... First aid box here. Right away in Stimpak. So then this... May be accessible. Alright, yep. Oh. Well. I'm over here now, so... Still says caution. I'm just gonna go back. Oh! Oh, there. Yeah, up there. I don't know how to get up there. It's fine, you can keep shooting at me. I'm gonna leave now. Oh. Or not. <laughs> Game crashed. Load. Auto. You know, I'm just gonna... Yeah, honestly, I'm just gonna go this way. I'm just gonna... Do fast travel. Okay. Or maybe not. Oh, cannot fast travel while enemies are nearby. Well, um... <laughs> I'll make enemies not nearby then. <laughs> yep. Saying down here to go? Oh, yep, it is. I'll go this way then. Have I been down here? I mean, I think so, because the marker was available. Guess I'll go this way. Oh, Raider. Ah. Ah. Oh, there's this door. Museum station. It's not the marked thing though on the map. I don't think I can go this way. So then, I guess I go back. Uh, that's got rubble in front of it. A doorway over here. Uh, 
does not look like it. So back up I go. Out this way. Seward Square. Okay, I guess I didn't discover this place yet. Um. Uh oh. Music. What? Oh. 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 Oh, grenade inbound. I got grenades too. Oh! Okay. Twenty stim packs left. Weapons. Um, you know what? Laser pistol. Okay. Slow hammer. That's it. Use the laser rifle instead. Sick animation. <laughs> Arm hurt. <laughs> No, no, no eat arms, please. Okay. Reload. Um, okay, maybe not that way. <laughs> friend over here? Oh yes, there is. Be you and the worm. Make him shut up, please. Just make him shut up. Oh. Uh, why don't you just go over and see what he's yelling about? No. No way. He'll set the bombs off if I go anywhere near him. Oh, come on. He'll listen to reason. Go talk to him. Oh. Uh. Oh. Um. Well, you look like someone who's pretty smart. So if you say so, I'll give it a try. Oh, no. Okay. Here I go. Uh. Oh. 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 <laughs> okay. Uh. Okay. Um. Alrighty then. Hey now. Oh. 
No more of that, please. Going here. Because I had the swords. Is this the place? Oh, yep, there we go. Ranger compound found. Very hard. Okay. Riley's Ranger's Eyes Only. If you're reading this, you better get your ass out of here. Oh, okay. Come on now, but I am... I am friend now. I go here. Hello. You look like you've been through hell. No, it was just all in a day's work. You're a cocky little thing, aren't you? I like that. <laughs> well, as much as I want to hear all about it, can you tell me a full debrief on what happened out there with my men? It went extremely well, as you can see. We didn't lose anyone. I'm very impressed at your skill. I don't think I've come across someone quite like you in the ruins. I suppose I owe you a debt, and I intend to pay it in kind. I'm sure you're more interested in your reward than listening to me talk, so let me get right to it. No, please continue. Your men are more important than my reward. Losing a bit of the Merc Edge, eh? Don't get soft on me now. Well, I've said it once, but I'll say it again. You have my thanks. I'd be pretty lost without my guys. So, for your reward, what'll it be? The Ranger battle armor, or one of Brick's miniguns? Ooh, okay. Armor or minigun? I'll go for the armor. The armor it is. Wear it with pride, kid. We do. Consider this place your home away from home. If you're ever in the neighborhood again, you're more than welcome to take shelter here. I guess that does it. See you around, kid. What's the deal with the talent company? Let me give you a word of advice. Stay away from them. They give Burks a bad name. They have no morals, no remorse, and wouldn't hesitate to put a bullet through a defenseless man's head if it meant a job. They've been pretty active lately around the old Capitol building ruins. I'd recommend giving that area a wide berth. Have you had run-ins with them? Yeah, we've crossed paths. Fortunately, we just stepped out of each other's way. Brick almost turned it into a damn bloodbath when one of them spit on her boots. But I was able to hold her back. What's been happening since you've been back? I don't know. I'm not sure I'm cut out for this kind of job anymore. I almost got everyone killed in Vernon Square. What kind of a responsible leader does that? It was one bad decision after another. We all make mistakes, Riley. You're not a fortune teller. Yeah, but I led the guys right into a corner. Theo died because I decided to take shelter in the hospital. I'm not so sure I'd be trusted leading anyone at this point. No, Theo died because of bad luck, that's all. Thanks. You're sweet to try and make me feel better about everything. I just hope that I can get back to mapping the ruins soon. I have a lot of contacts that are demanding I finish. Let me help. You stay here and I'll do some mapping for you. You'd risk your neck for me like that? Sure, why not? You look like you need the help. Well, okay. I hadn't expected this, but I'll certainly take you up on it. Oh, and I insist on paying you. I won't take no for an answer. For every map marker you uncover in the Capital Wasteland, I'll pay you a fair sum in bottle caps. All you have to do is find them. Come back here and I'll get them off your pit boy there. Done deal. I'll okay as many as I can for you. Here, take this geo mapper. Please don't lose it. Donovan spent a year developing it and I only have a few. It will offload all the map data you collect from your pit boy automatically. 
When you come back, I can take the data from it, and you get paid. My place is yours. Kick your feet up and relax. Kick your feet up and relax. Okay. <laughs> Empty cabinets. Riley's terminal. Riley's Ranger's eyes only. Hope you asked Riley first, you dumbass. Okay. Current personnel listing. Riley. File unavailable. Brick. Position. Heavy weapons. Age. 24. Term of contract. Ongoing. Merits slash demerits. Five. Five merits. And one demerit. Pay. 50 caps permission status active brick is an outstanding asset to the rangers i find her zeal for destruction to be an asset rather than a liability she is reliable and calm under fire although she can be a bit impatient during mission planning phases or debriefings she seems fiercely loyal to the rangers and would be great oh be a great go-to person in the event of a falling out in the ranks okay butcher name butcher position medic age 31 term of contract ongoing three merits pay 70 caps permission status active butcher is an important part of our team he is prone to making rational and logical decisions even in the heat of battle which makes him ideal for a secondary command position his medical skills are moderate at best, but oh, with room for improvement, but he continues to scour every hospital and clinic we happen across to learn more about his trade. His loyalty to the Rangers is without question. Donovan. Donovan, position tech. Age 35, term of contract ongoing. Two merits. Pay, 50 caps for mission, status active. Donovan came to us highly... Came to us highly recommended by my contact in the Brotherhood of Steel. He is an absolute wizard in regards to the repair of our firearms and personnel, oh, personal armor. I wish he had more knowledge of electrical systems, hydraulics, etc., which would help us circumvent obstacles we frequently encounter in the ruins, but hopefully this will improve with time. His loyalty to the Rangers seems solid, but it may take more time to gauge. Theo. Position quartermaster. Age 22. Term of contract probationary. One merit. Pay 35 caps for mission. Status active. Theo is our newest ranger. His role in the quartermaster. Oh, is the quartermaster for ranger compound. He cares for and organizes all of our equipment and carries anything extra we might need into the ruins when we're on a mission. He is with us on a probationary contract, which is up for review pending my decision. Okay. Current contracts. Mapping contract. Contract. Ruins mapping. Status ongoing. Projected income unknown. Acquired income 1765 caps. Description. Terrain and structure mapping for the District of Columbia urban sections. Make notes of enemy resistance, weapons, caches, strategic positions, retreat points, etc. Pro provide detailed files in holotape format to buyer. Buyer to remain anonymous and pay via caps left in predetermined spot known only to Riley. Okay. Super Mutant Eradication. Contract Super Mutant Cleansing. Status ongoing. Projected income unknown. Acquired income 2850 caps. 
This is three dog, bow wow. Description, eradication of super mutants at Riley's discretion. Fire will award a varying amount of caps base, oh, on a per kill basis. Proof of slain super mutants must be provided to buyer before payment is authorized. Buyer has approved various body parts as proof. Riley's personal notes. Personal entry 176. Well, Brick and Donovan were at it again today. I swear, if I have to break up another fight between the two of them, I'll go crazy. As long as they keep it off mission, I guess I shouldn't care so much. I just want this group to stick together. It's been a month since we lost Dallas and Kira. They were assets to the Rangers, and even though I've taken Theo on board to bolster our numbers, he's hardly a replacement. He's green, but maybe with enough muty blood splashing on his boots, he'll wise up real fast. Personal Entry 177 I've gotten the approval from Mr. Smith for the mapping project. It's going well so far. Definitely easier than hunting down muties. The caps have been good, so we'll stick with it unless something better pops up. We had a little bit of a run-in with Talon Company today. Those pricks always have to start shit with us. And unfortunately for them, Brick was with us. Needless to say, it wasn't long before I heard Eugene's familiar whine and she started dropping them like flies. We got, of, we got out of there with no casualties, but I think for now we'll give the Capitol building a wide berth. Personal Entry 178 Butcher and I slept together tonight. He'd always been kind of flirty with me, but I took it as a typical Merc, oh, as typical Merc humor. Well, I was wrong. I hope this wasn't, oh, this hasn't jeopardized our relationship on a professional level, but I really want to continue. After all, it's been a while since I've been with anyone, and it's nice to know someone out there cares. I think we're going to try and move on to the next sector of this downtown ruin of the downtown ruins this week. I want to finish Tacoma Park first though. There's still a lot of nooks and crannies in that place and it wasn't f if it wasn't for the Talon company and super mutant resistance in the area, we'd be done by now. Personal entry 179. Well, Theo's been itching to go on a mapping trip, so I'm taking the entire group into Vernon Square. I usually like to leave someone back at the compound, but the sector is brimming with potential loot locations, so I need all the muscle I can get. Butcher is anxious to check out our Lady of Hope Hospital and get supplies while I want to set up a transmitter on the Statesman Hotel. I hear Brick and Dunman going at it again. I better get these guys on the road before another fight begins. Oh, fight breaks out. Another fist fight breaks out. Oh, okay. On mower, on mower blade. Howdy, Ranger. Howdy, Ranger. Howdy keeps talking about you. I think you made a friend. You made it. Great. Need patching up. What's been happening since you've been back? Things seem better now. Riley's gained back her confidence a bit. We've been doing stuff here and there. I don't know what you said to her, but thanks. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm hurt. <laughs> All right, hang in there. Let me see what I can do for you. <laughs> um. You made it great. Need patching up? I have to go now. If you need us, you know where we are. Okay. Uh oh, you're back. Something need fixing? What's been happening since you've been back? Oh, wow, well... Riley snapped out of a slump now that you're mapping for the Rangers. Now we go out and kick ass like the old days. Hoorah! Yeah, my equipment has seen better days. Well, let me see what I can do about that. I 
have 38 caps. <laughs> Here. Pair of the shady hat. Now I have one cap. I have to go now. Come on back soon. Oh, brick. Well, all right, you're back. What's been happening since you've been back? Now that you're part of the team, Riley's her old self again. We've been vaporizing hostels like there's no tomorrow. I have to go now. Adios, kid. Adios. Grab anything you need. Ooh, stim packs. Medics. Stim pack. Ooh, and two blood packs. Five, five, six. Ten millimeter rounds. Can just take whatever from here, I guess. Welcome back to the compound, kid. Whatever is available, that is. Grab. Hey there. Got anything good for me? What's been happening since you've been back? Well, I've been feeling a little more confident now that I have you mapping for us. I think we'll head out into the ruins and do some search and destroy to ease back into things. I have some mapping data for you. Excellent. Let me offload the data and I'll be glad to pay you. Oh, I do? Oh! Okay, I guess I do. 15... 1560 caps. I guess I did. Um, alright. Is that literally just, like, all I have? Um, like, is it, okay. What I mean is, like, is that, like, everything that I've ever discovered? Is that why I got so much for that? Secure passage to Point Lookout. Okay, that's that. You gotta shoot him in the head. Uh, yeah, this is a this is the questionable quest that I don't know if I actually want to do or not. I don't know if I want to just go shooting people with the sniper rifle. Like I don't know. I don't know what for. I don't know for what reason why I would do that. Besides the one person not liking them, and that's literally, that's literally it. That's the only reason. Go back to Megaton. And sell some stuff. Hey. Alright, you know what? Let me see if there's a trader outside the walls. Because maybe I'll just trade with them. Deputy Weld. Thirsty, partner. Try Moriarty's. All this drink is too much. Okay, maybe not. Maybe there's not a trader out here. you to have this. I hope it helps keep you safe. Certainly, thank you. No, thank you. Shotgun shells. You again, eh? Nervy bastard, aren't you? Mm, well, I'll just go into the clinic and buy, like, as many stim packs as I can get. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. Okay. You came in here on your own power, so you must not be busted up too bad. You're a doctor, right? I could use some help. I'm um, okay. You're right. You do need a doctor. Lucky I happened along. But first, let's discuss my fee. 100 caps ought to cover it. On second thought, I'll be fine. 
Then stop wasting my time. I need to buy medical supplies. Not quite as good as that vault stuff you're used to, but it'll do you. Okay. Oh, I forgot about that. AP plus 5, luck plus 1, small guns plus 10. Damage resistance 24. Oh, this is broken. Okay. Well, um, yeah. Aid. Mm, take Psycho. Take the Nuka Cola Quantum. And, uh, a Mentat box. Here you go. Jet. Um. Okay. Misk. Oh, G Geomapper module. That's right. I did get that to do the mapping stuff. Pack of cigarettes, pre- oh no wait, I keep those. I keep the pre-war books. Pre-war money, and ammo, items. Do I have any weapons? I don't think I have any weapons to sell. Keep the bottle cap mines just in case. Okay. And now time to buy stim packs. There. Now how many stim packs do I have? 44. Okay. Get rid of three of these medexes. And, um, what else do I have? Right away, I'm gonna keep all of those. Okay. You done? Good. I have to go now. Yeah, bye. <laughs> yeah, bye. Suitcase. No, no. Women and children of the earth, come forth to gather and behold the power of Adam. Um, and I guess we'll go back to the house here, actually. Because I think I might have something to put down. Oh. It's been an hour and a half and... My voice. Ooh, my throat. Here you go. Wadsworth. Oh, I forgot about this. It's still set up and it didn't, like, drop anything, so. Oh, I forgot about that, too. I'll go up to... What's in the refrigerator? Four purified waters are in the fridge, so... I'll just put this one in there too. So now I have five in there. Good evening, sir! What can I do for you? Here we go. Oh... Two atoms are in a bar. One says, I think I lost an electron. The other says, are you sure? To which the other replies, I'm positive. I have to go now. If there's anything you I think I've already from, heard all the jokes. Ask, That's unfortunate. There's not more jokes for Wadsworth to tell. I'll 
save him now. Over this one. Okay, now, what? Over here, the Republic of Dave. Over there. Temple of the Union, I haven't discovered that yet, but it's on my map. Canterbury Commons. Not discovered. But I have discovered Minefield, so... It's the one that's closest to this. And then down here... Oh, Rivet City? There's someone in Rivet City to kill? Okay, now. I don't know about that. Dukov's place. Go to Dukov's place. Okay. Tink, 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 tink. I've got the best horse in the wasteland. Two of them are going to break my bed. Who the hell are you? Okay. Never mind. You need a drink. Jerry, I'm thirsty over here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Who are those girls and where are their clothes? They're my party girls! I'm too much man for just one woman, so I need two! <laughs> I wear them out every night. Why should they bother getting dressed when I'm just going to take it off? <laughs> okay. What are you doing way out here by yourself? Eating, drinking, farting, and screwing! <laughs> Out here, nobody bothers me. I can do whatever I like to whoever I want. Okay. So those girls are just your whores? Hey, watch your language, clown shoes. I don't pay them. They take care of me, so I take care of them. We rub each other wrong all night long. <laughs> okay. I'd better leave. Don't let the door hit you in the ass, clown shoes. <laughs> I don't want to kill Dukov. It's pretty, <laughs> pretty sick character. Well, don't. Nope. Well, aren't you looking fine? Talk. Hi, sweetie. I'm Cherry. What can I do for you? Why aren't you dressed? Dukov likes to keep it hot. Ain't no need for nothing else. So what's the deal with that, oh, with Dukov? He's a lecherous old man. The only reason I put up with him and his needs is because I'm safe here. He tends to shoot first and ask questions later. Don't pull out a weapon near him. He's likely to shoot you. And he's really good. Thanks for the warning. No sweat. So, what exactly is this place? It's, well, it's Dukov's place. He lives here. Pretty much, he just does a lot of drinking and partying. Okay, I need to get going. Bye. Oh my, aren't you a stud? I'm Fantasia. If you need something... Just let me know. Who are you and why are you dressed like that? Dookie doesn't like me to wear a lot. He says it slows things down. Dookie. What's this Duke of Dukov's guy oh, this Dukov guy like? He's alright. He can be a real fun guy, but he sure knows how to wear a girl out. Most of all, I'm safe here. I wouldn't pull out a weapon, even just to show him. He gets kind of paranoid about that. Don't get in a shooting match with him. He's really good. Your life, your choice. Damn straight. I have to go now. Yeah, see you. 
I mean, yeah, they, they, they did choose to stay. I mean... Ooh. Hey now. Hey now. There we go. Hidden. No. And this too. And, uh, this too. And, uh, <laughs> and, uh, where does the other one go? Oh, there it is. And this too. Okay. Um. One we have a shot. Bye. Detected. Oh, because they're okay. There they are. I see now. It didn't. Okay. Ooh, wait a second. Sugar bombs. Card of cigarettes. Hello, pal. What you need? How about a drink? No? Suit yourself. Okay. I better go before I get a headache. You need to drink more. <laughs> Okay. Good. Good pal. Oh. Hey, good looking. Does he pay you for this? <laughs> of course. Why else would I stay with the old fart? You you don't think I actually love that bastard, do you? Oh, okay. Time for me to go. Later. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't... I don't want to kill him. Like, I, I mean, I don't... I feel like I still don't have a reason to shoot him for anything. Like, what did he? What? What did he do? Big idea. It's the big idea. I don't know. Kicking around bottles on the floor. Hi there, fella. I'm Fantasia. Can I help you? Does he pay you for this? He gives me some caps, but it's not what you think. He can be a nice guy, and when the lights go out, he's real fun. I have to go now. Yeah, see you. Oh, okay. Hey, let's get wasted. I mean, really stinking drunk. <laughs> what you need? How? Okay. There's a pack of cigarettes in there. And the other one. Damage garden gnome. What you doing, honey? You ask about drinks, but I am not allowed to uh I'm not allowed to take them. Hey look, I have a weapon out. Look, I have a weapon out. Hey now, look, I have a weapon out. Thought I thought I was gonna get attacked on sight. Hey, let's get wasted. Oh. I mean, really stinking drunk. <laughs> Shot it. It's a I'm out of I'll here. teach you. Son of a bitch, I'm out of here. Uh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get shot. 
I don't wanna... I don't wanna shoot him. I don't wanna kill him. I mean, I don't... I feel like I don't have a reason to still. Money! Like I don't, I don't feel like I have a reason. Why, why, why kill uh, Dukov? He's <sighs> he framed Oasis. He framed. I know kill. I go to Dave. Let me see Dave. Go through minefield again <laughs> to get over here. No, no, that's fine. Just to run right past. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't be alarmed. Don't be scared. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna do that. They plant. I thought I collected a majority of those from here. Unless they respawn, but. Ooh, this. Ooh. Hello, friend. I forgot. Oh. Sick. I actually don't have to fight. It's friend. This is friend. Hello, friend. How is it going, friend? I'm out of here. What is that? Oh, Robo Brain. No, no brain. Weapons. Oh, I didn't use those. Thought I did. Unless I died. You know, I don't think I died. At all yet, actually. Ooh. Okay. Energy cell. Take the scrap metal. Energy cell on scrap metal. Okay then. Uh-oh. More- oh, that's not a robot. Is that a raider with a- The Roach King. <laughs> okay. Fight back. No. No more, please. The Roach King. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Roach King. If we would have just talked, I wouldn't I wouldn't have killed you, but you sent your roaches after me. Hunting rifle. Oh, another friend. Ooh, another two friend. Hello, friend. They're damaged, though. Or the one was, anyway. Okay. They... Yeah, this... Um... Okay. I didn't know about this, but I guess, uh... The animal friend perk is, uh... It's 
working out all right, I think. And get through here without killing them. So, hey okay now. Ooh. Oh, I guess vicious dog. Look, not vicious. It's friend. Your little friend. It's a doggy. The doggy no vicious. The doggy friend. Go up here and see what, see what this place is. Okay, is this a location? Um. Um, where? Oh, hello. Ouchie. You are not friend. Pull this out. Where'd they go? Okay. No more. The screw this! Oh, hi. Oh, hi, Mark. Bye bye. Oh, I did use mine, so I'll repair it again. 21 damage. Millimeter round, so cancel. Mine's already repaired to as far as I can repair it. Keep using the laser pistol. Open up three stim packs. Ouch. Won't pre war money. Free war money. Money. Microfusion cells. Five frag mines. Oh, Chinese assault. No. Hey, missile launcher. Okay. I'm almost at maximum carry weight. But I'll just repair my stuff so then it goes down. Okay. If I take this off... Oh no wait, I can repair this? Oh, with the Ranger battle armor. I don't want to do that. Oh, that's right, I could have got it repaired. By someone at like... Megaton. Or something. My... What's my horsepower at? 98. I shall continue on my way to Dave's... what is this? Dave's... Oh, the Republic of Dave. Yes, I'll continue to the Republic of Dave and see what, uh... See what I find there. See what happens. Um... oh. Hi. Ouch. I have poison now. Aid. Ow. Ow. 
No more, please. Take all the poison glands. station Ranger battle armor is the best non power armor. Oh, okay. MDPL 16 power station. There's people here? Oh. Please contact your local planning authority to construct a new residence. Oh, hey there. Do you need something? Oh, here we go. I've got some stuff that needs repairs. Sure, I can fix most anything. Let me see what you've got. So then I'll just repair my Talon combat armor. And I'll put on the Ranger armor and then put the Talon armor back in the house. Something wrong with your robot? I've been wondering about that for an hour now. I think it's stuck in some sort of loop. I tried fixing it, but all those switches and circuits are beyond me. I can try to fix that robot for you. Thanks. If you get it working, I have a couple of energy cells you can have. Just come back to me when you're done. Oh, okay. Speech check. That's a complicated job. I'm gonna need some money. Well, I guess that's fair. I'll throw in 100 caps if you fix the robot. Plus the two energy cells. See you later. Bye. Okay, here we go. Destroy the robot. You must have a repair skill of at least 40 to try to fix this robot. <laughs> Leave the robot alone. I'm not gonna I'm not There's gonna break it. Trying to fix this heap of junk. Damn it. Ah, oh, the dog is dead. Please go to the pound to obtain a new one. Okay. What is my skill anyway uh, for repair? 36. So next time I level up, I can like, I can do that. Hello again. How about that robot, huh? Um. Okay. So then. There's nothing wrong with the outside of you. Something wrong with the inside then? Ah, oh, the dog is dead. Please go to the pound to obtain a new one. Okay. Well, on I go. To Dave's Republic. Or, yeah, the Republic of Dave. Okay. Here's the gate. You've discovered the Republic of Dave. Is that yours? I've <laughs> just lockpicked the door. Don't worry. I saw you take that. I saw you take that. Take what? Uh, my entrance after I opened the door. It's kind of late to be entering the Republic. I'm not here to hurt anyone. What is this place? This is the Republic of Dave. Duh. It's named for President Daddy. But you have to talk to him if you want to stay here. I think I'd like to meet Dave. Okay, I'll take you. But President Daddy doesn't always like new people. Okay. Reload my weapon. So I am prepared.
Okay. No. Oh. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Here we go. President Daddy, there's a wastelander who wishes to see you, sir. Oh, I thought it was gonna do like a zoom in. We have someone new in my republic. Um. Um. I am Dave, president of the Republic of Dave. You will address me as Mr. President, or I will have you executed. Okay. Are you applying for a citizenship, asylum, or just vacationing in the Republic of Dave? Speech 100%. Most exalted President Dave, I am an ambassador from the Wasteland. You are? Excellent. It's good to see that the Wasteland has finally recognized the Sovereign Republic of Dave. If the people of the Wasteland are generous and respectful, I might deign to annex them. Anything happening in this place, Mr. President? There's an election for the next president. Don't look so surprised. Can't you see this is a republic? I really wouldn't know. I just got here. Ah, a seeker of knowledge then. Well, trust me. An election is what separates a president like myself from a monarch like my father. So your father was a monarch and you're president? How does that work? My father inherited his political power from birth and renamed this great nation the Kingdom of Tom. Although I also inherited my political power from my father when I took over, I formed a republic so the people may elect their leader. Could I help with the election, Mr. President? All right, sure, why not? The people have a tendency to wait until the last minute to vote, but I'd like just to get it over with. I'll spare a few caps if you just tell each of the adults to get over to the voting booth sometime today, so I cinch the victory. Not that I have anything to worry about. The people know who their leader is in this republic. Did you already vote, Mr. President? Of course I voted. I was the first to vote. Now I'm just waiting for the rest of the votes to come in. Tell me more about the Republic, Mr. President. The Department of Tourism usually handles all questions for outsiders. Make it quick. here in charge here mr president that's right as president i am head of the department of tourist rights the office of immigrant affairs and the bureau of dave like activities dave like activities My duty, second to the presidency is commander and chief of the army of dave the most ruthless military in the wasteland I'd be interested in learning more about you, Mr. President. Years ago, I freed these poor people from the wrath of Tom, former monarch of the Kingdom of Tom. Afterwards, the people naturally elected me as their president and the Republic of Dave was formed. Any future plans for the Republic, Mr. President? <laughs> well, the Republic of Dave is the only true sovereign nation in the Wasteland. The only really civilized place left in the world. One day, all Wastelanders will be citizens in the Republic and know the greatness of their president. That's all I need to know. Well, good for you then. I'd like to discuss the election with you. The election is still going on. What do you want to know? Who's eligible to vote? That would be Bob, Shauna, Jessica, Rosie, and myself. In the Republic, if you're old enough to carry a weapon, you're old enough to vote. 
Rosie and Jessica are usually here in the capital. Bob usually hangs out outside near the Brahmin pen. Shauna runs the Museum of Dave, so you can find her there. Who's running in the election? Nobody except me. Why would the people need anyone else but Dave? I give them all that they ask for. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for presidency. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, but the president must be a citizen of the Republic to run for office. So you do not qualify. Actually, I think I have all the info I need. Yeah. Actually, I think I have all the info I need. Anything else? I have to go now. Very well. Okay. Again, I, 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 I don't, I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot Dave. 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 Friend. Yes, and yes, I can see you eyeing it. Man. Awful today. Do you have the key? Dave's special key. Stop, thief! Oh, okay. <laughs> so am I not able to take that? I'm just gonna go through this again. Man. I am Dave. Pre Okay. Very well. Brahmin smell awful today. I really Acquires hope key. breaking into there. President Daddy, there's a wastelander who wishes to see you, sir. Okay. Oh. Pick this up. And go back here. Yep. We have someone new in my republic. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Requires a key, which I do not have. Well, I'll talk to Jessica then. Dave says you're okay? Fine. I'd like to know more about the Republic. You should talk to Dave, but okay. Tell me more about this Dave guy. That's President Dave to you, Wastelander. Call him by his full name, or we'll shoot you. He takes care of all of us. Even that selfish Rosie and her brats. My children will be a lot nicer than hers. Could you tell me more about yourself, Jessica? All I have to say is Dave is my husband. Mine. Do you understand? I don't care what Rosie has to say about it. Just because Rosie used to be this big leader out in the wasteland, she thinks she's better than me. She even ordered Dave around once. You're Dave's second wife? First wife. Rosie is the second wife. Since she's the oldest and not good for anything anymore. What's your take on the Republic? Dave is a great leader. He's going to bring civilization back to the wasteland. One day, they'll say it all started here. That's all I needed to know. Okay. I'd like to discuss the election with you. I'll help you if I can. Who's running in the election? Only Dave. He's the only person who ever runs. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring for... And run for the presidency. Um, did Dave say you could do that? 
Have you considered running for the presidency? No way. You'd have to be crazy to run against him. Oh, okay, I'll say this again. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for the presidency. Did you ask Dave if that's okay? I think I get the idea. Let me ask you something else. Anything else? See you, Jessica. You're safe as long as Dave says so. So wait. Oh, okay. Ammo. You don't have the key. And he has... What? Okay. Oh, this is ammo I can just take. And it's not stealing. Okay. The words of the Museum of Dave. Ooh. Oh, okay. This is all just here. Where the heck... Where is everybody else? Ooh, pre-war books. Nope. found a vault limited edition bobblehead. The inscription on the base reads, only through observation will you perceive weakness. Your perception has been permanently increased by one. Okay. Really from the wasteland? Whoa! <laughs> Talk to Bob. Yes? What is it? Come on, I don't have all day. I'd like to know more about the Republic. Shauna runs the museum, not me. What the hell do you want? Dave has two wives? Yes, he does. And they're both pains in my ass. Always got to keep them in line or else they get all teary. Tell me more about this Dave guy. Dave made me second commander of the army of Dave. And that means I get a gun. Don't make me have to use it. So I'm Bob. I'd like to know more about you. All you need to know is that I'm second in command next to Dave. So don't bother me. And don't talk to Rosie or Jessica either. Those are Dave's wives and they have work they need to do. So what's your take on the Republic? Dave is in charge. When he's not around, I'm in charge. If you want anything else, go to the Museum of Dave on the left side of the compound. That's all I need to know. Oh, great. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Oh yeah? What about it? I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for the presidency. Um, I don't think you can do that. You'd better ask Dave. Have you considered running for the presidency? Man, I'd love to be the president. Everybody would have to listen to me or I could just exile them to the wasteland. And the first thing I'd do is make myself the permanent leader so they couldn't vote me out in some other election. But there's no need for me to run. One year, Dave is just going to make me the leader, just like my grandpa Tom did for him. Oh, okay. Dave is corrupt. The Republic needs a new champion of freedom. I'm not stupid. You're just pushing me around. Oh. I think you should go for it. Yeah? Well, it just so happens that I like being number two around here. So I think I'll just stay right where I am. Wait. Uh just don't bother me. I've got stuff to do for Dave. Okay, I'm gonna load back and I'm gonna try to, uh... I'm trying to get it... Try to get that speech check to go through. Come on, make it fast. I got... 
collection. Oh, I already has these set up. Have you considered running for the presidency? Man. Yeah, I'll show them. When I'm in charge, everyone will have to say I'm as good as Dave. Better even. Okay. So I'm Bob, I'd like to know more about you. All you need to know is that I'm second in command next to Dave. So don't bother me. And don't talk to Rosie or Jessica either. Those are Dave's wives, and they have work they need to do. Okay. What's your take on the Republic? Dave is in charge. When he's not around, I'm in charge. If you want anything else, go to the Museum of Dave on the left side of the compound. That's all I need to know. Oh, great. Later, Bob. Just don't bother me. I've got stuff to do for Dave. I said that Dave was corrupt, though. You better get out of here. I better get out of here. Wait, why? Why am I not allowed in here? Are you really from the wasteland? Whoa! Oh. Okay, it is red when I'm out here, so. Oh, come on. The seesaw doesn't work. Hey. So, Dave gave you the okay, huh? Well, welcome then. I run the Museum of Dave, where the children of the Republic can learn about their heritage. This guy, Dave, has his own museum? Oh, yes. Everything here is from Dave's adventures in the Wasteland before he founded the Republic. I give a tour every day starting around 2 p.m. You should stop by then. I'd like to know more about the Republic. Sure. The Museum of Dave is happy to answer any questions on behalf of the Republic of Dave's Office of Tourism. Dave has two wives? Dave revised the restrictive marriage laws of the Kingdom of Tom shortly after the Republic was formed. Multiple marriages is now considered one of the great free freedoms of the Republic of Dave. Tell me more about this Dave guy. President Dave is the savior of the Wasteland. Bringing peace and order to the savages man has brought upon himself. If you would like to learn more, please stop by the Museum of Dave's official tour at 2 p.m. Tell me about yourself. Me? I just run the museum and teach classes to the little ones. You know, truth, justice, and the will of Dave. What's your take on the Republic? The Republic of Dave offers a rich history rivaling that of the great nations before the war. That's all I need to know. How very Dave-like. I'd like to discuss the election with you. Me? I'm not sure if I can help you. You know, Bob is running for president. Hmm. I don't know that he stands much of a chance against Dave. Have you considered running for the presidency? Absolutely not. In fact, I'd vote for Dave twice if I could. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for the presidency. Um, did Dave say you could do that? I think I get the idea. Let me ask you something else. Anything else? Does the museum accept donations? thought about that before. Why do you ask? Speech 100%. Hey, thanks for the follow. I happen to have some souvenirs from Dave's past for sale. Oh, wonderful. I'd be happy to accept your contribution on behalf of the Republic. And Dave just increased the budget for the museum this year, too. I was going to buy books for the children, but this is far more important. 
I'm ready to sell you those Dave relics. Great. What do you have? Dave relics. Oh, I can just literally sell things. Dave relics. Well, here, take all these frag mines. Those are some pretty good Dave relics. <laughs> hold on to the frag grenades. I got that repaired so now I can put on the ranger battle armor. Forgot about that, so... Dave stood on... Dave stood on those frag mines. Yes. Well, of course. Dave stood upon the frag mines, yet he did not explode. It is a symbol of Dave's great, great leadership where no matter what will happen, the situation will never get <laughs> out of hand. Dave is immortal. <laughs> yes. Well, of course. Why would Dave not be immortal? Why, why would anyone, you know, believe otherwise? Here, these poison glands, too. These are all, these are all relics to show the strength of Dave. Okay, I think that is, I don't know what, I do have, um, where is it? I thought I had a new Coca-Cola, oh no, wait, I didn't, I didn't steal it because I reloaded, that's right. 99 caps. Okay. Do I have anything else to get rid of? Get rid of the Psycho. Um... Okay. Exit. What wonderful items for the Museum of Dave. I need to get going. Bye. What wonderful items for the Museum of Dave. Oh, I've heard of Dave. Oh, Rachel. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. They're bad? But why? Come on now. Me and Dave are friends. And that's why I want to run against him in the election. I mean, how how does one compete with someone who's uh who's immortal? Hi there, honey. But have you spoken to Dave? Oh, I haven't spoken I heard that to you. Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. Um I'd like to discuss the election with you. Election time is always exciting around here. You know, Bob is running for president. Hmm. I don't know that he stands much of a chance against Dave. Oh. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring and run for presidency. Um, I don't think you can do that. Better ask Dave. better ask Dave. Have you considered running for the presidency? Believe it or not, I used to lead a group bigger than this one on an old caravan route. I did it for years, and we did pretty well for ourselves. But what am I talking about? Running against Dave would be like betraying him. No one stands a chance against Dave. <laughs> I don't know. You could lead the Republic into a new era, the democracy of Rosie. You're right. Dave's just been pushing me around. It's time for a change. There we go. Getting more people to get into the election. I'd like to know more about the Republic. Sure, honey. But don't make it too long or Dave will start wondering why we're talking. You're Dave's first wife, right? He has two? Well, yes. Dave and I were married when he was wandering the wasteland, before inheriting the Republic from his father, Tom. After Ralph was born, Dave said that the President of the Republic needed to repopulate the Wasteland. So, now we have a second wife. <sighs> Tell me more about this Dave guy. Dave is a good man. He looks after all the children and makes sure they have plenty to do. He's bought a lot of toys, not that he'd admit it. He has our Shauna teach classes to the younger ones. 
She's over at the Museum of Dave to the west of the Republic. What can you tell me about yourself? Not much to say, really. I'm Dave's wife, or first wife, I guess. I've lived here for many years now. Many years? What's your take on the Republic? We have plenty of food and water here, and the compound is fairly safe. I'm glad the children can be raised here, away from the wasteland. I'd like to see more trading done with the local caravans, but Dave's afraid their outside influence could weaken the Republic. That's all I need to know. Sure, honey. Goodbye, Rosie. Goodbye. Take care of yourself. Is there anyone else to convince to get into the uh, election? Oh, she's sleeping, standing up. Hey now. Um. Oh. No. Okay. Desk. Eight bottle caps. Okay. Scrap metal. On the floor and sitting. Yes? Did she not notice the bed right next to her? Um. Morning. Hello. I mean. I don't know. Maybe it's just more comfortable <laughs> to sleep standing up. I think I recall one of them saying something about the bed. Oh no, wait, that might have been somewhere else. What's the big idea? Actually. Yeah, I think that was actually um at Doko's place. Rosie. Hello. Can I convince Dave? Out with it, Ambassador. This Republic isn't going to run itself. Um, okay. I'd like to discuss the- oh, discuss the election with you. The election is still going on. What do you want to know? Looks like you might have an opponent in the race, Mr. President. An opponent? Seriously? But... But... Wait. No, this is a free republic. Let the people make their choice. I am confident that they will recognize me as their true and proper leader. Okay. I'd like to throw my hat to the ring and run for the presidency. I'm sorry, but the president must be a citizen of the republic to run for office. So, you do not qualify. How do I... How can I become a citizen? Actually, I think I might have all the info I need. Anything else? I have to go now. Very well. So then. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Dave says you're okay? Fine. Hmm. You should go vote if you haven't already. I'm gonna go look. Yeah, see ya. I'm gonna go see if there's anyone, anyone else, to, uh, to talk to. Hey, President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. But why? You, oh, are you really from the Wasteland? Whoa! Whoa. More scrap metal. Uh, another foreigner in the Republic. Okay. I think that might be it. Come on, make it fast. I got chores. Um.
You should go vote if you haven't already. Fine. I'll get out of the way. Okay. Museum of Dave. No one in here. Oh wait. Oh, woman's quarters, okay. Women's quarters, rather. Um... Casual wear. Hi. <laughs> okay, so then, are they all in the... All in this building here? Oh, hey. Hey now, that's a, that's a nice, uh, that's a pretty good shadow. It's like, <laughs> floating in the air. Shadow texture. Oh, it looks like water, kind of. Interesting. Hi. Cursed shadow. Hello. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Should go vote if you haven't already. I guess you're right. I'll go right now. Okay. Yes. I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. Should go vote if you haven't already. You're right. I'll go right now. Okay. All done. Dave's the best. <laughs> Dave's. Hey there, are you gonna play Christ. Republic with us? Oh, flower. Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. Wow. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. Something you need? You should go vote if you haven't already. Oh no. Dave sent you to tell me that, didn't he? Wow. <laughs> yeah. I'll go right away, I promise. <laughs> Wow. Hi. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are you are really bad. from the wasteland? Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. 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 Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. Wow. Excuse you. Hey, Daddy. Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. Wow. I told you not to talk to me like that. Shut up. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. Hi there. Bye. Hey. You going to vote? Something you need? Go vote if you haven't already. But I did already. Okay. I have to go now. Yeah. See you. Almost like hey, real children. Going on? President Daddy says they have real dialogue. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic the are bad. real dialogue. Uh Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Hey there. The most alive characters ever. <laughs> for a reason. Don't get any ideas. Did everyone vote? Yes. What can President Dave do for you? I'd like to discuss the election with you. The election is still going on. What do you want to know? Looks like all the votes are in, Mr. President. Good. The votes are in. If you'll excuse me, I'll be getting started on tallying the numbers. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Here's your caps. Keep this up, and I may deign to make you a citizen in a few years. A few years. <laughs> no. Okay, there goes Dave. It's unlocked. Hey. No, requires a key. 
let's see what we have here. Hey! Oh, I can open this. Take all this. <laughs> I took them all in front of him. So what's gonna happen? Vote for Bob and vote for Rosie. Can it be a recount? A vote for me. A vote for Rosie. Bob? Wait a minute. Has somebody tampered with the ballot box? <laughs> hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Rosie! Rosie can't be president. No. This is unfair. This can't be. Fine. I'm leaving. See how you people do without me. Enjoy your new president. Okay. <laughs> I took... <laughs> I took them right... Right out of the thing. So wait. I took him right out of the thing. I still have this. Right out of the thing in front of him. Yes? What can pro Did I get these? Oh wait, okay. Let me go do this quick. Something you need? Um Okay. Dave says you're okay. Okay. Hey there. Are you gonna play Republic with us? And yes, what can president communist? Uh oh, over here. Oops. <laughs> oh no. Hi. See, I thought. Hello. Are you really from the waste? Oh no. Dave says you're okay. Let me do this again. Hey there. Wow. So wait, I can make Bob or Rosie. Good to see you. I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Okay, where's? Hey there, are you gonna? Are they the only Bob people that can vote? Did I already ask Bob to vote? Let me go see. Now this time it'll be saved. Where? Where did Bob go? Where did? Yeah, where did Bob go? Fingers crossed. Dave's the oh. best. Come on, make it fast. Who the hell made you the bump? Okay. I'll save now. I'll save over this. So, yes. Bob or Rosie? You know, I think I think I'm still gonna do. Yes. What? Um. Here we go. Tell Shauna that Dave commands her to. Oh, Shauna. Any ideas? Hey, I heard that Dave allowed you. Oh no! Wait. Something you need? Okay, there. Now I'll save after. Ah, Dave, lead our republic to glory. No, no, Shauna, not. Morning. Hey. No, no, perfectly normal height. Yes? I don't know what you're talking okay. about. Save. Are you okay? <laughs> yes. President Daddy says the people from outside the Republic are bad. Okay. Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. wow. Yes. What? Here we go. Looks like all the votes are in. Good. The votes are in. If you'll excuse me, I'll be getting started on tallying the numbers. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Here's your caps. Keep this up, and I may deign to make you a citizen in a few years. Okay. Save. Hello. Bye. I'll wait for a ballot box. Let's see what we have here. <laughs> Just get rosy. There we go. A vote for me. And another vote for me. A vote for Rosie. Wait a minute. 
Has somebody tampered with the ballot box? Hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Rosie! Rosie can't be president. No. This is unfair. This can't be. Fine. I'm leaving. See how you people do without me. Enjoy your new president. I guess you're wondering where I'm going. I'm off to annex old only and forge the new Republic of Dave. Don't try to stop me. I guess you're one. I guess. I guess. I guess. I guess. I guess. I, I, I guess you're wondering where I'm going. I'm off to annex old own. Hey, anything going on? Rosie, Howdy, mister. Rosie's the new president. Where's, Hello. where's Rosie? Morning. Where's Rosie? Was she in there? Where's Rosie? Hey there. Here? He doesn't sound mad or anything, I guess. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Oh. Well now, who could have ever thought? Me, president! Oh, things are really going to be different around here. Listen, I can't thank you enough. You convinced me that I could do this, and you were right. I want you to have something. Dave kept some big weapon or something locked up in the safe in his office. The code is 1138. It's yours if you want it. We don't need it anymore. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, I can take the vote. Notes. Oh. <laughs> vote for Rosie. Rosie. <laughs> vote for Bob. Bob. Vote for Dave. Dave. Hmm? Oh, wait a second. This is something that I was... supposed to give? Or something? Nadine, I guess. My darling little Nade. I know life wasn't always the best at home, and we've had a few rough winters. I don't blame you for running off to find something better. At your age, you think you're wasting away at your home while the world's just waiting for you to come get it. When I was about your age, I ran off from my mom, too. And even though there were some terrible things along the way, it ended with me having you, so I can't complain. I just wish you could have seen your grandmother. I wish I had a chance to see her again myself. If you're reading this, I just want you to know you're always welcome back home. Please learn from my mistake and don't stay away forever. Missing you, XOXOXO, Mom. I think it's from Point Lookout, yeah. From the, uh... From the dock, where the, um, the ferry, or whatever it is. Remember, I need genuine sugar bombs, and they have to still be sealed in the box. Bring them back here to me at Northwest Seneca Metro Station, and I'll pay you for each one you bring. Murphy. Okay. I'll go get the go get go get the weapon, I guess. On here. Down below. Here we go. Old painless. Ooh, okay. Hunting rifle? Maybe. Bottle cap forty two and I'll take that. I've lost karma. For what? I was given the code and, uh, you know, whatever. Whole painless. Okay. Does it do the same amount of damage as the hunting rifle? Oh, 15. Oh no, it does more. It does more than the hunting rifle. 
and it is less conditioned, so I think it does do more regardless. So then I can... I can get rid of the hunting rifle. Value 72. Go sell it somewhere. Can I repair this one with... Oh, I can just repair this with the hunting rifle. I'll just do that. There you go. Ooh. Why are they running? Hi. Are you really from the wasteland? Wow. Wow. Just save. Save in the Museum of Dave. I'll actually keep this save because it's for the ballad. Save over this. That isn't yours. I'm getting out of here. Ah! I've got one. <laughs> no. I give up. Switchblade out of the desk. Come on now, no weapons on school premises. The heck. Damn things got violent real fast. <laughs> I'm just standing. Yo. Oh. Heartbeat sound. No more? Put my weapon away. <laughs> they said it at the same time. <laughs> the the effect of the double. Rip shot of the small human. No 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 no. Perfect height. Hello. Perfectly normal height, I should say. But now this is empty, anyways. I oh, didn't see that. Oh, didn't see that. Here we go again. Why not? I'm getting out of here. Leave me alone. Out there. <laughs> I don't know if it'll happen like last time. Are there any barrels out here? Oh. Oh, that one doesn't move. Because you can just run into people with barrels and that'll do damage. And they don't attack you because you're not attacking them, Morning. technically. 
President Rosie? What's happening around here anyway? President Rosie? President Rosie? President Rosie? As president? You've got to be kidding me. No, no. Rosie president. Hi. Are you really from the wasteland? Whoa! Whoa. Okay, well that was, uh... Dave's Republic. The Republic of Dave. The question is, does it change name? Eventually. Where to next? Rivet City. So kill somebody in Rivet City as well, or is it like... Yeah, because Mr. Crowley is down in Underworld, so like... I'd be killing someone here. But why? Why would I do such thing? Okay. I already got all of this stuff from when I was here the first time, I think. Here, I'll take this with me. Uh, I was gonna say, or not, but it's still here, so I can... Hey. ...still go up. Bridge tower. Oh, I can pick this up. There was an armory, I think, around here somewhere. Wait, deck. Where's the armory? Is it up further? Detergent. Oh, right here. Save. And I'll talk to Private Jones. Sir, yes sir. Private Jones reporting. Oh, here we go. Private, there's a security emergency on the flight deck. Sir, this slag heap appreciates the intel. Moving to secure the flight deck, sir. Okay. Bye, Private Jones. Now I can take stuff. I forgot I got my speech skill up. Oh no. Breaking bobby pins. Garden of cigarettes, microfusion cell. Oh, 75 to pick that. Well, I don't have that, so. Won't do that. Take this. Items. Oh, I have three? Well. Right there. Does the Robit come back? Lockpick speed run. Yeah. Bobby pin breaking speed run. 
5 millimeter rounds and pre-war money. Empty. I'm gonna save now. Okay. Very hard. Go out of this way. Ooh, see a box over there. Oh, danger, caution? Uh-oh. See, I did this before and I got in trouble for going out the door. Yep, here goes. I'm waiting for... Waiting to get attacked. I... Um... Uh... Uh... Caution? Am I not gonna get attacked? What's happening? Caution, but for what? What's happening? Uh, uh, what's going on? <laughs> Kids are attacking. Um, maybe you don't know who you're talking to. I'm Chief Danvers, head of Rivet City Security. Whoa, I just wanted to ask you something. Oh, what happened to Chief Harkness? He's gone. I'm in charge now. Did you want something, or are you just wasting my time? I found this letter in Seacrave's... Seagrave's room. I thought you should see it. This is bad. Seagrave Holmes was angling for a seat on the council. You can forget about that now. Once the market vendors get wind of his past, they'll never trust him. Too bad. What's up with that James Hargrave kid? He acts like such a brat. He's trouble. That's what he is. I don't trust him, and neither should you. His mother's a drunk. Spends all her time in the muddy rudder. Uh, okay. You've been very helpful. Duty calls. Okay. What? What is happening? Oh! Did he, uh... Oh. Back over here again. Not able to get down from here. What's that? Oh, whatever it is, it might have fallen down. Uh. Um. <laughs> what are they doing? I'm gonna go out. It's the flight deck. Caution. What? Where are they going? Ah! Oh, what? Oh, where? Uh... Something out here? Yes. <laughs> um... Uh... Okay? Uh... Good? Okay? Hey there. Hi? Uh... I don't know if that's the proper way to hold that. 
Uh. I'm on duty. Make it quick. Uh. Kind of lost. Can you help me? I suppose. He's learning. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> Who's in charge around here? <laughs> Depends. Chief Harkness is in charge of security. He patrols the whole city. Security bunks down in the tower. Dr. Lee kind of runs everything else. She's in the aft. That's the northeast end of the city. Uh, time for me to go. Later. Uh, you done? You done? Uh, wh where? Don't blame him. <laughs> okay. I'm looking for troublemakers. Have you seen any? Uh... Is it because I said... There was something going on on the flight deck? And they like... Activated? I'm going back in. Okay, I think they I think they stopped. Yes. I think they're done. Hello, mister. I think I'll go have some fun. <laughs> I heard that Danvers found a letter from Slavers in Seagrave's room. That will teach that bastard to mess with me. I think you've earned a permanent discount here. Oh. Deathclaw Gauntlet. I need you to repair my stuff. I'll see what I can do. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I'll get this re-repaired for three caps. Repair my shady hat. Oh, lucky shades. Ooh, okay. Can repair my fat man. Damage. <laughs> Damage plus 143. Yes, please. Combat shotgun. Here, repair my 44 Magnum as well. I haven't even used it once yet. It's been a pleasure, Mr. Bannon. Come back soon. Okay. Now I'll actually switch. And I'll put the Talon combat armor away at home. What are you looking at? It makes me feel safer knowing you're around. Have a seat anywhere. Someone will be with you in a minute. Evening. Hello. What are you doing? Okay. Where did... Is Seagraves now gone? Because of the... Letter? Keep moving. Closing time. Oh. One of the new immigrants died of radiation. Okay. Closing time. There. Locked. Average. <laughs> I can go right back in. Okay. Yep. Hello. Keep moving. <laughs> this better be good. Duty calls. Keep moving. Now let me go back. Is it locked now? No. Now I can get in there even You're when. Low life, but if you keep your nose clean, we'll let you stay. I'm a low life. Why do you say that? Still holding the gun. It's <laughs> still, still floating the gun. I see. They're all eating dinner at Gary's. They'll still sell to you, though. Just ask him. 
Okay. Who? You said they are all eating at Gary's, but who? I'm looking for troublemakers. Have you seen any? Nope. Hard. I don't have the lock picking skill. Bottle cap. Open up. What's inside? I've been in here before. I believe so. Ooh. Let me see. Are there any sugar bombs in here? There are. Okay. Yes. Just figure out which station to go to to get those sugar bombs back out. Oh, broken terminal. Science lab. Oh, here. <laughs> uh. Me and me. What brings you by Rivet City today? To go now. I suppose that's goodbye then. Come again anytime. Okay. Um. Whiskey. Ooh, hard. Wait. I can get in. Ah. This might be faster to just and keep trying to brute force. Uh, maybe not. Pro hacker. <laughs> yeah. Just keep trying over and over again. And don't do it a fourth time or you get locked out. Declaration Expedition. Recovery of the Declaration of Independence seems to be a loss. That damn woman I hired, Sydney, she said she could do it. Do it. Haven't seen her in months. I bet she's dead or ran off with the advance I gave her. That's the last time I trust someone. Told Harkness to keep an eye out for her just in case she ever comes back to the city. That's what I get for sending a woman to do a man's job. Oh. Well, it got done. Because I already brought it back, so. Lincoln Artifacts Expedition. Come to find out through the grapevine that there are a bunch of Lincoln's artifacts still in the Museum of History. Think. I may branch out from just collecting documents if I could get my hands on those gems. Only problem is I have to find someone braver than me who can get to the museum in one piece. Okay. Liberty Bell Expedition. Bumped into a traveler a little while ago who showed me what he said was a fragment of the actual Liberty Bell. Poppycock. The Liberty Bell is still intact and laying in the ruins of Philly. I funded an expedition to that dump in the hopes of having the entire bell brought back to my museum. Okay. Well. Some more. Get some more XP and I'll be able to level up again. Then I can do the repair skill to repair the robot. Refrigerator. Oh, sugar bombs. Take those. How'd I go?
go bring some of those back actually now. Forget where it is. It's in one of the stations, one of the metro stations. Cut it out. Oh, science lab. Ooh, foot locker I could get open. Make it quick, will you? I'm coming down. Just wait seven hours. Did you hear about the fight in the muddy rudder last night? Yeah, Bell's gonna have to replace some tables and chairs. I'm sure she'll just scrounge some from the lower deck. Okay. Wait one more hour. Welcome to a quick fix. Oh, hey. <laughs> Some random dude standing in front of your room for seven hours. Not creepy at all. Wanna do some buff out? Maybe a little psycho. <laughs> no, no, I was I was sleeping like uh, Jessica from the the one building in uh, the Republic of Dave. Perfectly normal activity. Understandable. <laughs> yeah. See, it's a perfectly normal thing that, uh, people do. Oh, hey. There we go. Hidden. Yep, still hidden. There we go. That's all I wanted. I'm watching you. Okay. Not anymore. Hey. Ted, could you please not put your stuff on hey the bed or all over the floor? Bye. Hello. Yes, sir. I have to get now. Yeah. Okay. I'm out of here. What is that? Thing in here to uh oh bottle caps it's green so it's not stealing Oop, there we go energy cell and a pack of cigarettes oh hey there we go level up repair to 40 martyr to 70 Should I get my speech to a hundred? That is the question. I think I'm gonna do that. Yes. <laughs> mm. I'll get big guns leveled up actually. Some missile launchers and stuff like that will do more damage. <sighs> lockpick though. I'll do a lockpick next time, I think. Additional five points to weapon. Oh, see? 
repair skills I can get plus five to anyway from the uh, from that. So if I right, Let's see. science. So I'll do lockpick actually. Or yeah, I'll do lockpick. Medicine. Because this will give me repair, right? Repair skills. Five points to small guns and repair skills, yep. Now let me check my stats. Stats. Yep, repair 42. So now I can go try to repair the robot. Oh, this isn't stealing. Hey now. I'm out of here. Marketplace. Weatherly Hotel. Have I been here? Oh, Bannon's door. Something in here too. I already got that. Okay, nope. Young's door. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Oh, more sugar bombs. And more sugar bombs. Ooh, a flakin' shrapnel's a door. Six rounds. How are the conditions on these? Eh. Take the 10 millimeter pistol and see if mine is damaged or not. Yep, it is. There we go. Repair. And I actually forgot I got my repair skill up, so I think I can repair them further anyway. Hey. Checking up on me or something? So how are you getting along now that you've left Great Itch behind? Oh, Vera's the nicest lady ever. It's so cool that you brought me here. I mean, she makes me do stuff, like clean up her hotel and all that, but she really cares about me. Plus, I found some friends here in Rivet City too. All thanks to you. I have to go now. See ya, mister. Here we go. Welcome to the Weatherly Hotel. Mr. Buckingham. Welcome to the Weatherly. Mr. Buckingham at your service. What is this place? This is the Weatherly Hotel. It's the finest establishment in Rivet City. How much for a room? And a mere 120 caps. Sounds like a fair price, I'll take it. I love these Fallout robots. <laughs> oh yeah, the robots are pretty sick. Sounds like a fair price, I'll take it. Excellent. Simply venture into the hallway, turn left, first door on your left. That is your room. Is that the broom closet I always get those two mixed up? Okay. Who's your owner, Rust Bucket? Miss Vera Weatherly, proprietor of the Weatherly Hotel. Not that it's any of your business. What do you have to eat? Please place your order. Here we go. 
and sell the Chinese pistol because I already have one at my Megaton house. And the officer sword I have as well. So, just sell them. Uh, sell the Nuka Cola Quantum. I might actually be able to get my caps back. Um, pack of cigarettes, pre war money. Uh, maybe not. But the majority of it. That's all for now. Yes, sir. Fire's key. Oh, I can lockpick the refrigerator. No sugar bombs in there. Welcome back, sir. Nope. How much for a room? I already bought a room, but can I buy a second room? How much for a room? Only 120 caps. You won't get a better deal than that. I can pay again, but I already have one. <laughs> Thanks. Okay then. So long, Vera. Farewell. Who even locks a fridge? Can't let the. Uh, I don't know. He's dead. Uh, I, I I don't have an answer. I'm I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think of why he would, but nice I don't know. You. Um, hey you lock the fridge if you were transporting it, so things don't fall out of it. That's all I could think. But you know, if it's stationary, I don't really know. Here you go. Oh, broke one. Oh no. There we go. Dr. Preston's door. 44 rounds. 44 magnum round, rather. Suitcase. Metro ticket. Make sure I'm getting all these. Dresser. Bottle caps, pack of cigarettes. Okay. Oh. I don't think I've been in here yet. You're hurt. Fortunately, this is a medical clinic. Why don't you let me take a look at that? Patient is unconscious. Oh hey. Let me just steal these. While you're looking this way. Not a good idea. <laughs> Not a good idea. Empty syringe. Scalpel. Oh, requires a key. gonna save here and try oh wait doesn't no key for uh, dr. Preston's room key but not the key to the uh, medical supplies unless Unless I missed it in here somewhere, but... I don't think I did. Wait, what? Okay, I thought I saw something else. 
Noodles. Okay. No key. You're in the Revit City Clinic. I'm Dr. Preston. <laughs> this place looks easy to rob. You have any problems with thieves? Don't get any cute ideas. Security is just a shout away. Now, if you've got any medical issues, let's hear them. Um... I need medical supplies. Sure thing. Here's what I have. Oh boy. Well... 22 stim packs. How many do I have? 40? What is 10? Just gonna buy as many as I can. And I have 57 stim packs. A pleasure doing business with you. Bye, Doc. Take care of yourself. That's oh. secure for a reason. Okay. Do that from back here. I don't want to pull out the gun. Try again. Try again. Still hidden. Keep going. <laughs> okay, this time I'll actually try this. And see what I can get removed before making an attempt. That is that everything I can get rid of. Attempt. Just keep going. There we go. Rivet City Clinic computer system for doctor's eyes only. Unauthorized use will result in a f oh result in fine. Confinement or possible banishment by order of the city council. Okay. Regional health hazards. Apart from the standard dangers, Rivet City provides a few uncommon problems for long-time residents. Lockjaw, muzzle spasms, especially of the jaw from getting cuts of the rusty ship hull. Oh, cuts on the rusty ship hull. Treat with penicillin when available. Red lung. Respiratory problems from... Regularly inhaling rust particles, particularly a problem for hangar deck residents and shut-ins. Treat with steam therapy and time outside to flush system. 
fish poisoning. Less of a problem nowadays, but occasionally someone finds a fish in the river and it's and is dumb enough to try to eat the thing. Radiation levels spike and mercury poisoning drives most victims crazy. No cure, but at least people nearby get a reminder not to do it. Okay, patient files. Bannon, still suffering from his social problem, keep on penicillin and try to convince him to watch out in the future. Brock. Another day, another broken nose. Rare to see him as a patient, but at least the people he refers are still alive, barely. Kentelli, Polly. Treatment for the steady stream of his addictions would be a steady income, but I can't waste the resources on him if he's going to get hooked again. If he's just going to get hooked again, okay. Holmes, Seagrave. Chronic case of red lung from all his repairs below decks. Prescribed a few hours of fresh air up top every night. Staley, Gary. Exhaustion. The man really needs to take a rest at some point, but then again, who doesn't? Trini. Surprisingly healthy apart from the alcoholism, no, alcoholism and other chronic dangers of her line of work. Guess they grow on them strong in lamplight. Okay. Not a good idea. Patient is unconscious. Can I help the patient? Dr. Lee's door. I have to go now. It was nice watching your stream. Yep. Uh, have a <laughs> have a good day or night. Uh, and I'll see you later. Thumbs up. size bed. Well, locker. Very easy. Bottle cap. Ooh. Project Purity Journal Entry 1, 3, 5. Oh. Activate. Oops. Ooh. Had a workbench combined wonder glue, leather belt, medical brace, and death claw hand. With this weapon, your unarmed attacks will have the ferocity and armor shredding power of the death claws, assuming you can survive long enough to take one of their hands, of course. We're back at work after a full week of delays. The Brotherhood soldiers were able to repair the sentry guns, much to my relief. I know Madison isn't comfortable having them here. But there's no denying that we'd be lost without them. We're still waiting on the full analysis of the last three small-scale purification tests. Catherine hasn't been feeling well, and it's slowing down our research. I don't mind, but I can tell that it's bothering some of the others. Okay. Project Purity Journal, Entry 3. Project Purity Journal, Entry 5. The team has made plans to scale back our work once the baby is born. We're also trying to compensate for the increase in mutant attacks. No one is really talking about the implications of it. There are more of them than before. We know it. The Brotherhood soldiers know it. Our relationship.
relationship with the Brotherhood is straining. They're concerned about the lack of concrete results from the project, especially in light of the new attacks. They haven't come out and said it, but we all know what's going on. They're questioning whether their involvement in our project is worth the trouble it's causing. They lost two good men this week, but three more injured. Okay. And that's the science yes. lab. Ooh. Locked. <laughs> I can use the key that I took. Open up. Hello. Hey. Shrapnel. Don't know you. Don't care. Keep it short. What's your problem? Loosen up, pal. I'm short on time, and your five minutes are up. See you. If you want any of this shit, just say so. Otherwise, keep your fingers the hell away from the triggers. I don't want no accidents. I'm thinking of buying some ordnance. What you looking for? Okay. Yeah, I could buy ammo, but... <laughs> Don't actually. I have 14 caps. Exit. Time to re <laughs> take it. Out. Come back soon. We always got a lot of ammo in stock. Hey. I think what I'm gonna do is probably go back to Megaton and. Put away uh, any stuff that I might have, and if you want go, then I might just uh, I might end the stream there. But let me see. Let's see if I can find the exit to here. Shrapnel store. Oh, average. Here we go. I was already in here, I think, though. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Hello. Is this door to stairwell? Okay. Everything looks okay here. Upper deck. Bridge tower. Quick loading. Oh no, no, I don't want to do that. Save here. I'm gonna go back to Megaton. Here we go. And go to the uh, the house. And then, uh, yeah, put away, put the Talon combat armor somewhere, and maybe, do I have any weapons that I'd like, like to put away? Don't really know. And nowhere else. Come on now, Nathan. you back to Megaton. I think I already told her about the um, letter. Here you go. My Megaton house. I, okay, weapons I put in here. So do I have anything to put away? I don't think so.
This has clothes in it. Is there somewhere where I can put this? Put it in here. With the, uh, Enclave power armor. I could actually get it to go the way I want it to, but I don't know if that'll happen. Ooh, let's knock it into the cups up there. There we go. Are there like that. <laughs> okay. So now save here. Yep. Okay. I think that's all I was gonna get rid of. I'll check quick. Misc. Oh, that's right, I have a carton of cigarettes, but I might just sell that next time. <laughs> there. I'll just get this to, like, oh, the camera because of the robot. Okay, yep. But I think for now, I'm gonna end it, um, I might, I may stream another time in the next, I don't know, let me see. Next a few hours? I don't know, cause I, I might, I might just continue, honestly. I'm just gonna be done. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm, for now, for now, I'd be done. But anyway, I already put it away. So, quit. It's a game. Still making noise. I can still hear the game for some reason. Oh, hey. Thanks for the follow. Um, but, yeah. Anyway. Um. <laughs> thanks for following, but, uh. <laughs> but I was gonna be, uh, done for now, so, um. I guess I might see you in the, uh, next stream or something, maybe? I, I don't know. But, uh, anyway. Uh, goodbye.